What's up everybody, D'Angelo here, and we are at Walmart right now, so I know you guys wanted to see a video on some retail arbitrage. Don't worry, the CPA video is coming or whatnot, but I also wanted to show you guys, I'm actually out here practicing what I preach, right? So check this out, picked up a, you know, a bunch of copies of some video games, you know, you see these ones right here are going to go for five bucks, you know, a piece. These ones here are going for three dollars a piece. These ones here are going for, you know, nine dollars a piece. These ones here are going for nine dollars a piece, what? You know, so literally, all you gotta do is go into Walmart and buy them, and then you are gonna have to hold them. That is one thing, like you are gonna have to hold them. Sorry for the background noise. I accidentally picked up this weak ass cart, you know. But you know, obviously, I got too many video games to hold by hand. So yeah, guys, literally, just go into Walmart, buy the stuff. Again, I'm telling you everything you need to know. You know exactly where I'm getting the games from. You know exactly where I'm selling them at. You know exactly how long you know I plan on you know holding them for. So if you can hold your games for two months, you know, or however, whatever you buy from Walmart, I always recommend you know at least like holding it for two months because then all the fuckheads are gonna sell out. You know, the people that are a little willing to buy video games or whatever it is that they buy, they're willing to buy it for $9 and sell it for 9 you know, in my spot, get profit of $9.50. You just spent $9 to make 50 cents. That's fucking stupid. I mean, like, literally, that's dumb as hell. But, I mean, it is what it is. It's Easter own. But, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to make this quick video to show you guys that literally all you need to do walk into Walmart and send some stuff in. You know, you don't have to get sales today. Don't focus on sales only for today. Obviously, you want to be sending in as much stuff as possible, but I mean, you don't need sales today. But that's why a lot of people, you know, newbies are messing up because they're focusing on getting sales for today. If I can buy something today for 50 cent and sell it in five months for 50, watch me hold it for five months, right? So that's what you got to do, guys. You got to hold it. You got to wait for the fuckheads to sell out. Just let them do what they do, you know? But that's pretty much it, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, all that fun stuff.